the Celtics are now coachless. Hmm. Any ideas on who you think they'll um, hire? I know you got ideas on it. So I have uh, a little insight. Rumor is Chauncey Billups is the next coach for the Celtics. That is the rumor. The reason is because ever since Kyrie's um, comments about Boston being hella racist, the Boston Celtics are trying to prove that they're not racist. And a part of that is hiring Chauncey Billups. In addition to that, Chauncey Billups is a great player who is probably going to make the Hall of Fame. Um, won a championship. Is somebody that can relate to the players. And the Boston Celtics are about to do a huge rebuild. They're going to get rid of most of their team. They have to. Everybody is for sale. Except for Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum. Do they get the first bid of who they keep? Or how does that work? They're just like, no, nah, you guys are on the market. I'm not. We're not going to try to bid, outbid anybody for you. Like, so how does that work? You have a, your you have your roster. Uh huh. You say, what can we get? Hmm. What do you have to offer? Make me an offer. People come to them with their offers. Oh, okay. And they say, I'm not trading this guy, this guy, this guy. Anybody else is for sale. Make me an offer. I can always say no. I don't have to say yes. What I'm hearing is that the only people that are off the table are Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum, Robert Williams, and that's it. Is it, is it the, their starting squad? Bro, why you They're two best players. Inside stuff, bro. <laughs> How often am I wrong? He's like Lord Ferris. How often bro. am really? I wrong? I didn't know that. I, this is new to How me. How often am I He's wrong? Like, <laughs> I've Not usually about from, this man. Dino so, is like Lord Ferris. <laughs> 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 I've heard something. How often am I wrong? I be saying shit, and then it actually happens. You be like, oh shit! Yeah. <laughs> this man is a monk. <laughs> <laughs> Real shit. I cannot. So here's here's the the biggest the biggest thing. Lots of people want Marcus Smart. Oh, my God. I forgot about Marcus Smart. Lots of people want him. And he's their biggest asset. Why wasn't I thinking about Marcus Smart? He is their biggest asset. Here's another thing. Rumor is Kimba has arthritis. Oh, that's sad to hear. And lots of people know about it. And he's under contract. And they can't trade him. Nobody's going to take him. Yeah, that sucks, man. Yes, it sucks. Is so. It, is it just like an arthritis brick? Is it? So it, how much did he get paid? Me. He has a max contract. He was making like $30 million a year. Ah, how much is AD you think making? I think we can look it up. I think he makes like 30 Yeah, but I mean, isn't that what happens like something. Chris Paul and these people? Like, I, I just think about like the idea of getting somebody and that's just going to get injured. It's just like these kind of glass, like expensive ass crystal shit. I mean, that's a gamble and that just, you they're make. They're just gonna be sitting on the sideline. Okay, we, we can get it. We'll get it. That's a gamble that you make. Sometimes it works out, and sometimes it doesn't. You but, know, but um, uh, but the Celtics' biggest asset right now is Marcus Smart. Uh, be on the lookout for a Marcus Smart trade, um, because it's gonna happen. He's not. He's not well, staying. He's their. He's their. Their biggest asset. Now with Marcus Smart, they're gonna try to unload contracts. Um, a rumor, a rumor, is that Memphis wants Marcus Smart. 
and the Celtics would want Valanchunas. It's a rumor. <laughs> All right. Yeah, if it happens, I want my claps and my snaps. You feel Can me? Can we get? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like there's like a rumor guarantee <laughs> set up here. All right, so. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so fans. So, um, that is that is that is the the Celtics right now. They are they're gonna need to completely rebuild. Um, they're doing basically an estate sale. Be on the lookout for that shit. 